Meanwhile, uh, shares of Kotak Mahindra Bank were under pressure after its joint managing director, KVS Manian, resigned effective immediately. He will be pursuing other opportunities in financial services. The resignation comes just a week after the RBI cracked down and two months after his elevation. Ritu Singh is here with more. Uh, Ritu, uh, where next for Manian? Well, uh, to begin with, KVS Manian's sudden departure from Kotak Mahindra Bank has certainly come as a surprise for industry watchers, especially, as you were saying, coming weeks after he was elevated to the position of joint MD, the second highest position in the bank. Now, in his resignation letter, Manian said that he was leaving to pursue other financial opportunities and that he was excited about his future professional options and he was moving with the belief and optimism that he can yet again find a fulfilling assignment. Interestingly, he offered to serve a longer notice period to help with the transition, but the bank accepted his resignation with immediate effect. Now, this has led to some speculation about Manian potentially joining a rival bank because of which Kotak Mahindra Bank may have relieved him of his duties immediately. Now, remember, Kotak Mahindra Bank has had KVS Manian associated with the bank for nearly three decades. He served in various positions, most recently as head of corporate banking, and he was serving as a whole-time director on the board as well. And he has for long been seen as, you know, Uday Kotak's right-hand man. He was also in the running to take over the top job. But, of course, that position ultimately went to an outsider, Ashok Baswani. Now, soon after, right around the time that reports surfaced suggesting that Manian could be a contender for the Federal Bank CEO position, Kotak Bank had promoted him to the joint MD position to sweeten the deal. And now this exit comes just weeks after, before Federal Bank has even sent any shortlist to RBI, hence the surprise. The markets are going to watch out for whether the new CEO can steady the ship or if there will be more senior or mid-management exits that will follow this leadership transition. And this certainly adds to the problems for Kotak Bank along with the IT issues, the business restrictions by RBI and now these senior management exits. As to whether he will actually be headed to Federal Bank, here are the bank's current CEO, Sham Srinivasan. Are you denying?